I don't support um, salmon farms. You know, I, I don't give a blanket endorsement to aquaculture. I have been on the inside, so to speak. I know what's good about some of these farms and what's bad about them, and a lot of them have no uh, consciousness about the environment at all. They're just there to make money. Um, when I first started off in aquaculture, I thought that I was going to save the sea, you know, save the ocean. We're going to farm seafood and we're going to teach the world's poor how to do it so they're going to have, you know, money and they're going to be better off. And um, just because the seafood is farmed doesn't mean that you're making an impact on the environment. It means that, you know, somebody's making money off the fact that the environment is destroyed. And I think it removes people from that whole issue of the environment when they buy the farm-raised product. I mean, I, I do buy farm-raised shrimp, and I'm not saying it's a bad thing, but it's not the final solution. It's not the complete solution. Um, not eating fish is not the solution either. I mean, seafood is a natural component of our diet. We should be able to eat natural seafood. So what is the solution? And this came to me after probably five years of working in the shrimp industry when I realized that you know, poor people weren't getting rich. Uh, the environment wasn't um, being saved. For example, in Ecuador, people started making money. What did they do? Well, they bought a faster engine so they could get more fish. They cleared down more forests so they could build more homes. I mean, it wasn't like they stopped and saw it and said, okay, let's protect our environment. They just had more means to destroy it. <laughs>